Hi guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're gonna showcase the latest release from Morgan Taylor. It is a collaboration with the Whitney Houston movie that's either coming out or already came out by the time you watch this video, I'm not sure. Um, so the theme, you know, the names and everything is based on the movie. This was sent to me as PR. Thank you to the Morgan Taylor team. And on my left hand, I'm wearing the red from this collection, which is showing a little bit too warm here on camera. It's a little bit cooler. And on my right hand, I'm wearing CND Shellac Lovely Quartz. So without further ado, let's get into the review and we'll talk about final thoughts at the end. Signature Sound. This one is like a cream, like off-white. It's a little bit chalky and I did get streaks on the first coat because my nails right now are very ridgy. And um, anyways, you can still see that. I don't know if it's the polish or if it's my nails, but if your nails have ridges, just keep that in mind. In any case, it was even an opaque for me on the second coat. I did do a tiny float, which is when you let the bristles, when you apply the polish without too much pressure, you just kind of like do it more gently and it allows the polish to self level. So I did that on the second coat, which we call floating and I got opacity and it was even at two coats, but otherwise you might need to do three if your nails have ridges or whatever, right? It was an okay formula. It wasn't the best, but it wasn't the worst. And the color is really nice, just a neutral, but it's a nice, clean, you know, neutral. So, blazing of the charge. And this color is the most beautiful thing. Like, like I was saying in the intro, it's showing a little bit warm here on camera, but in person it feels very cool. And oh my God, it's like, I think this is what people call like blue toned. I'm not exactly sure. It feels very like, classic christmas red it's gorgeous and then when you take it outside of direct br bright light you get like that christmas red it is so good the formula is fantastic now even though it's super opaque on one coat i actually recommend two because i feel like it elevates this polish specifically oh my god it's so gorgeous like i actually had to go ahead and, and wear it and keep it because i loved it so much highly recommend this one usually whenever morgan taylor brings out certain colors that have like they're like super good. They end up they end up like getting sold out. It's happened before with some of their cream pinks. So keep that in mind that this red is very, very good. And I have not seen any other winter collection being released this year from mainstream that has a classic um, Christmas red. So if you like this one, grab it. Because like I said, it's the only one I've seen in this specific Christmas red tone. So. If you like it, grab it. Belted out. And this one's a jelly purple base. It shifts a little bit for me between like some sort of like a, like a slight pink hint on the corner and then blue and then purple. And it has, I think it's hollow glitter. When you take it off focus, you can see it. It's a very fun polish. It was opaque for me at two coats, but my nails are very, very short. So I'm not exactly sure if your nails are longer or if your nail line is more pronounced, if you're gonna need three coats, but I doubt it. It was very good, very fun and mysterious. I actually don't think I own anything like exactly like this in my collection. So I'm very happy with this one, actually, even though it's kind of weird and I don't know if I'll wear it that much, I, I really like it. Next up, we have Record Breaker. And excuse me, but this is fantastic. It's like, um, it's not like, it's a black base with the, the shimmers that it has in it, it's like micro glitters, I think almost. They're not silver, they're not gold, maybe champagne. Maybe that's the word. Cause they're not gold and they're not silver. It's like an in-between, but they're very, very light. But dude, the opacity on this, oh my God, you guys. I mean, you're gonna see on the live swatch, the way this goes on is just freaking gorgeous. Now, even though it's like super like good and the first coat I recommend too, cause it will build it up a little bit nicer but it's so good. This screams New Year's Eve, screams New Year's Eve. I love it. Up next, we have Command the Stage, and this one's like another one of those burnt golds. Um, very holiday-ish. I think we've seen, this might be in, because I, I feel like I've seen a couple of these this season, like different variations of like, like a gold metallic. We've seen some pearly ones, some more shimmery, more metallic. This is another one of those, so, I've seen a couple of these, like I was saying. This one has very good formula, good coverage and all of that. Um, I'm not particularly like crazy about the color, but I always say that about gold polishes and then I end up 
wearing them like i actually grab them all the time so i don't know why i'm saying this like in my head i think i don't really care for them but when it comes to actually wearing them i do kind of grab them so i don't know anyways the formula is fantastic great quality so that's it all right certified platinum this one i think this color is like champagne like champagne shimmery metallic the formula is good coverage is good there's not much to say about it, it feels like a classic metallic that we see in holiday collections perfect for new year's eve or christmas or really whatever like an accent nail or anything um it's not gonna work as a topper because it's very opaque on its own i got full opacity i think it was in two coats so if you have big you know longer nail lengths or a more pronounced nail length you might need three but it's very easy to work with so if you like these types of shimmery metallics this one has good quality all right so i kind of already gave away that my favorite is the red i kind of like yeah i think i gave it that, i gave that away and then my second favorite is this one i think the opacity on this is very very good just easy to work with you put it on it just feels so glam and like stress-free you know um this three all had good formulas and then this one had the more tricky formula but again at two coats it was fine but yeah if i have to pick a least favorite it's not really because of the color because i wear these a lot it's just the formula you know and so this will be my least favorite one the rest were fun and i think it kind of like matches you know with the theme just wanted to show them to you guys as a short video because we only have six polishes and i'm not doing comparisons because i don't have that many things to compare and i never compare reds because they don't show properly and i struggle a lot so anyways here you guys have them if you like any of them you're not gonna have any trouble and that's it thank you so much for coming to my review and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye.